Saturday Social, brought to you by EA Sports FC with PlayStation 5. Welcome back to Saturday Social. As you can see, we've moved areas because we've got two guys in the studio who proclaim to be the best of friends. Are we saying you're best friends? Yes, 100%. absolutely. The best of friends, so it is time to play Football Friends. Oh, Football Friends! Here we go then, you proclaim to be best friends. How well do you think you know each other? Really well, and I'm taking this very seriously. Use your loaf of bread. Yeah, we're being think. very competitive. We're trying to beat a, a few YouTubers, a few football players. We're, trying got, to get ten. we're aiming for ten, aren't we? Eight ten out of ten. ten. Come on, boys. We've got to finish above James. Use your brain today, flag. mate. Use your brain. Come yeah, on. yeah I mean, Come you mentioned on. some scores there. Let's have a look at the leaderboard, shall we? Because there have been YouTubers taking part of this. There's also been footballs taking part in Football Friends. Ooh. As you can see, Morgan Gibbs-White and Nico Williams currently top of the table on eight out of a possible ten. James and Flav, these are the players you want to beat, do you say? Yes. Yeah, Seven out of ten. So you want yeah. to be really the best YouTube pairing, yes. don't you? Well, well, I want to be the best pairing out of everybody. We want ten out of ten. OK. Yeah. So well, we could aim for nine, even. Let's aim for nine. Nine be out of ten, be realistic. If you don't know how Football Friends works, basically it's the footballing version of Mr and Mrs. I'm going to read out a statement. They've got a match answers on their board. Every match equals a point. Ten possible points available. You both ready? ready. Yes. Pick up your boards and let's get in to Football Friends. OK, first one is about Boovy. Who is Boovy's favourite ever City player? Massive Manchester City fan. Lots of names to pick from here. OK. Easy. Easy, they say. They seem to think this game is going to be very, very simple. Off camera, they were saying they're going to get 10 out of 10. They say they know each other really well. Best friends. Let's reveal your answers to how well these best friends know each other. Sean, go to David Silva. Oh, what a no, fantastic no. start. Sean Wright Phillips. Oh, Sean Wright Phillips. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> David Silva. What a great Come start, on, guys. think. Sean Wright Phillips, David I Silva. I did actually know that. He was right. He got his own answer right. Yeah. I, did, I should have thought of that. I know, I know. Now I'm, I'm switched on now. See, I'm what's wasn't... happened here is you've been hammering into Boovy about not being switched on, and you yourself are not switched on. Right. OK. <laughs> this is tough, I think. This might be tough for you, Rory, to write an answer. Who is Rory's favourite current Chelsea player? Oh, easy. He's got to get this right. OK. He says he's got to get it right, yeah. but I don't know whether it's as easy as you think, oh, given the current on, squad boys. and the way Rory has been get hammering right. people. Three, two, one, reveal. Oh, no! Gallagher <laughs> and Thiago I thought he was going to go with the experience winning the Champions League, mate. No, I thought it was the, 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 the think... success. Yeah, what can I say, Rory? Mate, we have to get everything right now. We Conor, have to get them all Conor right Conor now. Gallagher. Really? Come Your on. standards have dropped as a Chelsea fan. I'm, I'm talking a, a Champions League winning centre-back. That's not his favourite player. Come on. What is going on here? He's had a mayor twice now. Why is it Conor Gallagher? He's a brilliant player for us. Passion. Brilliant player. OK, let's go to number three then, shall we? Because you need to get some points on the board. Come I on, mean, zero out of two Jesus. so far. Which coach does Boovy honestly think will replace Pep when he eventually leaves Man City? Really tough question, this. And no cheating, please. No cheating. You know, I've seen a few cheating allegations being made in the YouTube comments recently, and I just won't stand for it. Although Morgan Gives White definitely did cheat. No doubt about it. This is hard, mate. This I'm, is really hard. We've never talked about it. I think Guardiola's just going to sign a contract extension. OK, but one day he will eventually leave. We're not saying he's going anytime soon, but let's reveal those answers. Oh, oh, Arteta, what's wrong with you? You never want an Arsenal manager. All you do is slate Arsenal. Yeah, but he used to manage at City. He also used to lay the cones out for Guardiola. <laughs> the Zerbi's form with Brighton recently is a little bit up and down. Come on, Mikel, you think that's realistic? Yeah, I think he's desperate. I, I think, never I think you the would Arsenal say job is a stepping stone for a bigger club in Man City. Wow, Arsenal fans will be letting you have it. Zero out of three. It's the best you can do now is match. Flav and James. We can do this. Come on, Come on. Wake Next up, man. Up. Have a and coffee. I think this might be the first... I think this might be the toughest one of the day so far. When does Rory honestly think Chelsea will next win a Premier League? I'll give you... I want a year here is what I'm looking for, really. This is quite... <laughs> this, is, <laughs> this is quite hard, I think. I think this is really, this is really tough. Difficult. I might give you a one or two year leeway here because it's so hard. Three, two, one, reveal. Ooh! 2031! Yeah. What are you doing? But you're very pessimistic about Chelsea's current situation. But we're a team so that I was inherently I'm wins thinking, silverware. We're I'm a team trying to get, always win silverware. I'm trying to get inside the mind of Rory Jennings. Chelsea Rory. And he's been very pessimistic of Chelsea and Pochettino. And you're saying by this answer you're going to win in the league within two years? Yes. Oh, be Call it in a football show. Be realistic, That man. is realistic. <laughs> Mate, we're Chelsea. We always have, a, have the ability to turn it on. OK, haven't done it in a while, so let's do, the <laughs> let's do the next one, because that's over 4. 
Who would Booby rather have finishing a 1v1 to win the league? Haaland or Aguero? Now, I think this is the easiest one of the day. This should be a tap-in. If you don't get this right, this boys, we may have to end the yeah, show this early. Is concerning. Three, two, one, reveal. Well yes. done. Good. We're off the mark. Beautiful. Do you know what? I'd like to call that a pity point. That is one of the <laughs> easiest questions you'll ever get on this show. A pity point puts them at one. Next up, another tough one here, I think. Which Todd Burley signing does Rory think has been the most successful? Who's been the best signing of the Todd Burley era over a billion pounds spent? 19 odd signings. I think That's who has standard. been the best? I think so as well. I think this is a really good answer from you, Boost. Yeah, but yeah. the pressure will now start to mount on Rory to get this right. Three, two, one, reveal. Beautiful. Yes. Yes. Just in there. We're in sync now. Come Just on. Come back. Justin on. Timberlake, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> let's go. Cole Palmer, why Cole? Oh, he's fantastic, isn't he? He should, uh, I think he should be in contention for a starting berth for England. Mistake selling him? Uh, yeah, no, no, huge mistake. He, he wouldn't have huge mistake. He starts for bottom half clubs like Chelsea. He's already won you European silverware this year. Yeah, true. That is true. <laughs> better than Kovacic, better than Nunes. All right. Next up, let's try and get to three points somehow. What is Boovie's favourite ever Man City moment? Now, there's actually more to think about here potentially than you would expect because obviously there's the treble in there. Maybe there's the six-one. Yeah, six one was amazing as well. You know, there's a lot of answers you should here. Use your loaf of bread here. Think. It's not I obvious. Say this well. is obvious. I think so too. This is obvious. See, what you've got to be thinking here in football friends is what would your opponent and my partner write? Maybe look into each other's eyes. Try and get a bit of telepathy come on. going. Come on, come mate. on, come on. Okay, so come on. Three, two, one. Shambles. Oh, I'm sorry, <laughs> mate. I'm sorry. <laughs> Shambles. I could, I could cheat the game and say, yeah, every City fan's favourite moment is Aguero, but for me, the, the height of City was beating Man United what in the FA Cup semi-final. What do I possibly have of City getting that? It's just my, it's just my actual It's just opinion. some obscure favourite memory. No, when Yaya yeah, Torre scored against uh, Man United in the FA Cup. It's some obscure... Joe, you must remember that when we knocked you out the FA Cup. That's just some weird, obscure favourite memory. How am I supposed to know that? Huh? How am I supposed to know that? This is a huge goal. You the start of the new Man City If you ask any Man City fan, what's your favourite moment? Yeah. A non-Man City fan is going to go, well, probably a well, The obvious answer is De Bruyne for favourite player. Sean Wright Phillips is my... It's, it's about yeah. your emotional connection this to is a game with football me. roars. This is You're a meant game. to be working as a team, yeah, but It's just my genuine opinion. I don't opinion. know your emotional <laughs> connection to various... I've told you about the goal. It was amazing. Beautiful little finish You told me about the, the Aguero moment. Yeah, I have told you about that a few times. All right, OK. It's not going particularly Useless. well. So it, I, I'm, I'm having a blinder. I'm getting them all right. Yeah, at the moment, you could be genuinely on for a record worst ever football friend score, which on, is Fuad man. and Sharky on three, I think. So the pressure is on here. You need to like start racking up some points somehow. OK, next up, let's have a look. Where does Rory think Chelsea will finish this season? Now, we've seen the year. You think you're next going to win a league title. You think within two years. But where will they finish this season? And let's be honest here, please. Let's be honest. Look into each other's eyes. Let's try and get a bit of telepathy going in the room. Rory's gone what he believes is OK. Rory's changed his answer here. That could be detrimental. Three, two, one, reveal. Oh, Ten, oh. nine. <laughs> that. I don't think you're good enough for top half. I don't think you're good enough. <laughs> You're bottom half at the moment. Tennis top half. Uh, but yeah, middle middle of the table. I don't think you're good enough for that. Lads, honestly. Look at the size of the knife at the moment. They're good. <laughs> <laughs> lads, honestly, you've got to get the last two right to beat Sharky and Fiers. This three. is ridiculous. Okay, you've had a nightmare here. Who has the worst hot takes out of you two? Just say the right thing. Be, yeah. be honest. Be honest. Just be, be honest. honest. Okay. Write it down. Okay. Write it down. All I can say to you is be honest, do the right thing. Come on, Be boys, all you man. can be. Be Come a man on, of honour and principle. Okay, two, right, be in principled. <laughs> <laughs> on this show, it is the worst opinion in the history of football with a Harlan shout. You made that. You made <laughs> you that. You did, Rob. Oh. No, but I've also <laughs> get more right than you. No, you don't. About I do. what? No, every... You said Chelsea are going to win the league this season. It... You said you're going to win the league in 2026. No, I, get, I get way more right than you. I told you that Eddie Howe. I told you about Eddie Howe. What do you mean I told about Eddie you Howe? That he was, He's still I told you Eddie Howe would struggle. He's still in the job. I told you he would struggle. I told you Naomi would oh, be brilliant man. this season. You've got to put ego aside in the No, you have to put Rory ego aside. Yeah. man. Rory, I'm not going to lie. There is that record tape for you on this show where you did have Harlan no, down. Do, do you know what we have learned on this moment? This, this item on this show has taught us something. That I'm a man of honour and principle and you were a charlatan. 
You're just lying. You're just saying things that are right. nonsensical. OK, cost us. lads, seriously. Are we bottom now? You are, no, no, you can equal the bottom score with this. I think you can equal the bottom score with this. Joint it's not bottom. gone well. Yeah, joint Come bottom. Come on, man. After the pre-show hype of we could get 10 out of 10 here. You I, said, I said nine. I'm being realistic. <laughs> You yeah, worked it's together not that every we got week. Two. I think you described each other as best friends a minute ago. Yeah. Not anymore. Okay. <laughs> Final <laughs> one. Who is more argumentative out of you two? Oh, come on, God's sake. Come on. Hide your board. Seriously, do the right thing. Here. Okay. Just think. But I'm going to tell you now. I've started doing yoga. Okay. I'm going to tell. I'm started doing yoga. Mate, I'm going to tell you now okay. that I'm famously I'm just a you pacifist. Know. I don't pacifist. argue. Put an answer down. Everybody calls I've really me mellowed, I've really mellowed out in recent weeks. Have you? I'm really mad at the yoga going. Boobie. It's fantastic. Boobie. I'm, my <laughs> hamstrings have never been I've more been, elastic. I've been bit cramming from day dot. People <laughs> always call me Rory the pacifist. I don't argue. Oh, I famously B. don't argue. Yeah. I think. Do Three, the right thing. Two, one, reveal. <laughs> What's wrong with you? <laughs> <laughs> I've been doing shows with you on YouTube. Look, you're arguing. Years. You're arguing. You're proving the point. Actually, you're literally arguing. You're right. You're right. Fair play, Boobie. Mama stay. Namaste. I mean, two scored in total there, boys. I mean, what was that? That's embarrassing for you. You've let the club down. You've let the club down. Yeah, Adam McCullough and everyone. Yeah, yeah I can only apologise, guys. I uh, can't believe it. That Jay. is a shock. It's a new low for this show. We've <laughs> reached a new bottom. Let's have a look at the leaderboard and your names included on it. In a host of talent here, you know, <laughs> Gibbs White top with eight, Sharky and Fuad three, and that was a disgraceful effort. Today might be one of the worst things I've seen. Two, mate in the history of this show. I thought we were going to get 10. I really thought we were going to be good at this. Yeah. I'm not very argumentative, I'm not going to say anything. Two out of 10, they've both been practising their yoga. We'll probably carry the arguments on. 